show you how to make a 3D looking text and how to put it on a background or some sort of picture that you have. So first you want to open up Adobe Photoshop and you want to create a file, a new blank file, and you want it you can be whatever size you want. I'm just doing 1000 by 500 it's a good a good size to start out with and then um you want your background contents to be transparent and your color mode to be RGB color press ok and should have this then you want to click on your text layer and click on your image and I'm just gonna have it as background or let's have it as banner example and for YouTube and then once you have this you can make it different colors or whatever different sizes and you can warp the text I'm just gonna have it as let's see shower I'm gonna have it as bulge click OK it can stay like that go down here and then you want to right click on this because it's a text layer and you want to simplify the layer then you want to go to layer and then go to layer style and go to style settings you have choices you have your lighting angle which is where this will appear on your text but you have drop shadow glow bevel and stroke I want to show you each one of these drop shadow you have this little drop shadow I like my opacity to be 100% distance a little farther away in my size just to be about four for glow you can have inner or outer inner just makes it lighter I like outer better I'm gonna make it a dark blue color and I like my size to be kind of big and my opacity to be 100% for bevel this is what makes it look 3d and I like it around five or four around six and for stroke it just makes it more bold I like mine to be about one because it doesn't make it too big or too small and then opacity I like mine to be about 80 you just play around with these so you find what you like and it's not very hard and then press ok and you have this to be able to put your text on another layer first you want to right click on this and simplify the layer again and then you can just crop it to the size you want because it's going to be transparent on the next picture that you put it on anyway so press the little green check and then to copy it you want to press control a control c if you're on a mac you can press control a control command a or and control command c and then go to your other picture this is just a banner that I made and you can just press control or control command V and then you should have this and once you have this you can just click on this little moving tool and you can just move around wherever you want I'll have this and once you have that you can open any other kind of pictures. Uh, I'll just open this. This is just a picture I got off the site dragcave.net. And you can control A, control C, control command A, control command C, and then control or control command V. You can just add these other pictures to it. I'm going to zoom in 100%. So like, oops. 100%. It'll just look like this. I'm gonna move this around. Kind of stylize it a little bit. Oops. And there we go. See, we have this. And you can save it like this. This is just. But this is how you make text that looks like 3D, you can see. 
and it's pretty cool actually I like doing this stuff for my images and it's just pretty cool so thank you please subscribe comment thumbs up and have a wonderful day thank you for watching bye